Welcome back to the channel, guys. I truly appreciate you guys coming back to the channel. Appreciate you guys hitting the like, the notification bells, leaving vulgar language free comments. Appreciate you guys leaving donations, one and two dollars. They be adding up. Appreciate that, guys. You know, DeAndre Sanders, um, she's been kind of like passed around in the um, stars circle. So the guys from Hollywood, the rappers and stuff like that. I think she mostly messed with rappers here. So, um, and then it seems like she's holding on to this guy, Jack Quiz. I really would like for this relationship to last, but it has a lot of holes in it. It has a lot of holes in it. Let's break bread and get back, get back into it. Daughter turns around and buys him a car. A truck for proposing to her. Jack Quest proposed to Deion Sanders' daughter. Now, mind you, he was just exposed by Drezzy. He done spent all his money, all his time, all his creativity on Drezzy. They Deion Sanders, Deion Sanders' daughter, you know, she having a baby with Jack Quest. She told him, I'm not giving the baby a last name because we're not married. I'm not agreeing to that. I'm sorry. Next, Drezzy exposes Jack Quest. All right, so the kind of popular star, Jacquees, he is with Deon Sanders' daughter, Deandra Sanders. She's a very beautiful woman. He's a very handsome young man. But this relationship is everything but messy. It just seems forced. It really just seems like Jacquees got with Deandra just to get over his ex, Dreezy, because mm -hmm. it does seem like he was obsessed with Dreezy. He hurried up and got her pregnant. I think he was trying to get Dreezy pregnant, but she wasn't going for it. Deandra was. Her family is not too happy, so she was like, okay, well, the baby's not going to have your name, not have your full name. She wanted it to be hyphen, because why well, give my baby your last name, and we're not even married, so he hurried up and married her just because of that. Let's keep it all the way real. All right, so you don't Deandra do this Sanders, which is Deion Sanders' daughter, she basically gave him an ultimatum, like, look, we can stay together, but if you don't marry me, um, I'm going to give my baby my last name, which I would have gave my baby. Like, his last, I feel like her last name hold more weight. And I don't even feel like it. Her name literally holds more weight. So he went on and proposed to her, you know, of course, just because she, he wants the baby to have his last name. And I'm also sure he's trying to secure that bag. Then she goes ahead and starts looking for them for a house and starts upgrading his car. Like, ladies, the bar is set so low. Like, he wasn't even trying to marry you, and now you're doing all of this. Toxic for each other out in Mexico getting slammed on the sand over a bag of coke, allegedly. We did that interview, right? And now that both of their careers are just in the ground, he goes and meets Deion Sanders' daughter and impregnates her. I don't think Dresden could really get pregnant. They say, you know, substance abuse will stop that, make it infertile. Tell I said it, allegedly. I don't like that whole. I thought at one point during her career, she was a great rapper, she was gonna do well, but she let him again and don't take her down. But she really did. You know, now he got the girl pregnant. He proposed the other day. And I saw y'all in the comments talking about he just wanted the baby to have his last name right because that baby was gonna be a Sanders. Dion already told him, you don't you don't marry my daughter, that baby gonna be a Sanders. He proposes, and do you know what happened? Dion Sanders' daughter turns around and buys him a car, a truck for proposing to her. I have never seen anybody reward a man for proposing to them. Like you're pregnant with his baby. Risking your life to have his baby. He gives you a ring as he should. And you turn around and reward him with a car and tell him, baby, we're about to go house shopping. Because let's be honest, what is Jacquees doing? Besides performing at high schools and taking little girls to their prom <laughs> for money. What is going on? I'm not gifting nobody nothing, whether he had the truck or not. We're not rewarding men for doing what they're supposed to do. He didn't reward you before he got you pregnant. Anybody can throw some dick. Anybody can make a baby. It's an investment for him at this point. And for her to say, baby, we finna go house shopping. Yeah, he got the push gear. Explaining complex topics can be challenging. Let me give it a I like commercial. the text you want to simplify and let Grammarly rewrite it. 
Apologize. I think Deandra, she was just getting to that age and she really didn't care who the baby was with. But at the end of the day, she did want a baby. Her brothers really wasn't going for it because of Jacquees and probably just because of the drama between Jacquees and his ex, Dreezy. But the baby is coming and everybody just going to have to accept it. It's her life. She's 34. At first, boys, the boys weren't happy at first, but I think now they're starting to accept it. Yeah. Because that's, that's their big sister. Absolutely. Yeah, they want everything right. And nobody yeah. is good enough that's for your big sister. Nobody is good enough for Nobody. Y'all going to criticize anybody. Bro. Right. Congratulations on the Ray B. Grandpa. No. Don't congratulate. I've been telling everybody, don't congratulate me on that. But, First of all, I don't want to be no granddad. Right now. But I'm just saying. I'm proud of my who dog. Who he sound like? He sound like. That, who he sound that, like? I don't want to be no granddad Kim right was now. was pissed. Like, I'm like, that's right. Pop. Pop. I'm, I'm like, well, you Pop didn't Pop, throw rain clothes. I'm just like, Pop. I'm calling you Pop. Pop. I'm like that. Yeah, 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 when he see him, he'd be like, Pop. Pop. I'm like, yo. We all want that. I was mad. I'm like, you ain't. Bro, you said that soldier to war without no goddamn wife or no, <laughs> no vote to possess, you, know, you just hey. sent him out there alone by himself hey. like that. I'm happy. I mean, lady, I'm proud of my baby. She waited till at least she's 34. You know, some of them come out. I didn't even know you was about to be a pop-up. Yeah. So, Deandra. Yes. I didn't even know. Yeah. 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 And but you, you don't understand, but my sons ain't, ain't no joke. They mm -hmm. gathered up. So now, see, we have family FaceTime call. Yeah. It could be all five. Mm -hmm. It could be the three boys. It could be whatever it is. Yeah. We're going to talk about it. Yeah. So when I see all the boys calling me, somebody did something. Yeah. My boys weren't happy. <laughs> they wasn't happy. They, so, they protect their sisters. Yeah, so they protect their sisters. And they, they so mad. Oh, dad, you don't let, y'all don't let the joker get in the family. I know Shiloh. I know Shiloh. Oh, yeah. yeah, they were, they were, they were fighting mad. But they, I say, no, no, you got to understand that. It could be a blessing. No, oh, it's going to be the biggest been blessing. Pray, she's been praying. Yeah. You know, that one day she could be a mother. Mm -hmm. See, y'all don't even understand that. Right. Yeah. And God gave it to her. I understand you may not accept who she's with at the time, mm -hmm. but think about the gift from God that he bestowed upon her. Because mm -hmm. she's going to be a wonderful mother, and we're going to make sure of that. All right, quick intermission before we get into the rest of the video. This video was brought to you by Passion and Profit Academy, where we help people with no following to small followings make a lot of money online. Turn your passion to profit, help you start making money. No views, low views, get big views. And you don't even need a lot of views as long as you're building your YouTube as a business. So if you want to make a couple extra hundred dollars to extra thousand dollars a month online, definitely click the link in the top pin comment for the Passion to Profit Academy. Yeah, go follow her on her channel, guys. She seems like she has some great content. Let's get back to her video. Let y'all know. So my daughter go at it with anybody, friend, family, anybody. We all have to unfollow them. Because that's what she said. So Jack Quick's ex girlfriend went and spilled all the business. That he really don't F with DeAndre like that. He really just using her. Now, I can't prove that he is using her for her money, but obviously that's probably what it is. But when I say using her, I really mean using her to get over Dreezy. And he had DeAndre look like a clown online. And she really is too beautiful for that. She just looks like a classy lady. But somehow the classiest ladies always end up with the, you know, the bottom of the burrow man. I don't know how religious y'all are, but it's a man on YouTube named R.C. Blake, and he said that women with degrees always get played by guys who don't even have a high school diploma, and I'd be thinking that shit is so funny. The clinic is shaking, and DeAndrea Sanders, I need you to run, not walk, not collect $200 on the way. I need you to run down to the chop shop because this situation is beneath you. You shouldn't even be entangled in nothing like this. So this is a part two of the DeAndrea Sanders, Jacquees, and Dreezy drama. It's been going on, I had to speak on it. So let's talk about it. First, I'm gonna start by saying shout out to Dreezy because at the end of the day, what does Funky Dineva say? get paid for your pain. And that's exactly what she's doing. Dreezy is a rapper from Chicago. Jacquees is a singer from Chicago. They've been together for years. And now I guess they officially broke up. I'm telling y'all, I didn't even know they broke up. I had no idea. But she recently dropped a song called The, and they're saying it's in reference to what's going on with the DeAndre Sanders situation. The lyrics match perfectly. But Dreezy put on her story that she dropped this song like around her birthday last year, like March 31st of 2023. 
She actually posted the receipts of her playing that song. Like my song was been supposed to come out, but it just happened to be this situation because in the situation, Jacquees has been writing Dreezy long messages saying he wishes that he had a baby with her. He still wants to be with her. And it's looking very much like, no, Jacquees, you go over there with DeAndre Sanders, quit calling, quit messaging me, go ahead and have a baby with that girl. And it's looking like on paper that Jacquees doesn't want to. Now, after them going back and forth on social media yesterday, that was a complete debacle, and you can watch my last story for the information on that. But now, we're going to read what she said recently, okay? She said, I'm just so heartbroken. I don't ever think I felt like this before. But what? But it is what it is. I pray for God to show me it's big. I know we should never question God, but sometimes I question why even allow me to love this heart if you knew. I feel so stupid and dumb. If you want to believe that, then so be it. I actually don't talk to N-words with girlfriends. Hit while we was friends for so long. If anything, you're taking your anger out on the wrong person. He played you numerous times, not me. Now, now I want to be running back to you because I don't want him. Girl, bye. You really think you ate? You unhappy online and in real life go build a relationship with your daddy that don't really put you for real now deandre that was unnecessary you're trying to do a thing because you're hurt and your energy is directed at the wrong person you need to go and be mad at somebody else because saying that about her dad was unnecessary and jacques knew she had a, didn't have a daddy when he dated her and posted her what he has yet to do for you my beautiful sister because I'm not trying to hold DeAndre. I actually want her to get out of this situation. I think she's too good for this. I think she's beneath, you know, I think that this is beneath her. I do not think that she is less in this situation. Like, oh, I'm surprised she'd be caught up in it. Absolutely not. DeAndre, we could act like this never even happened. As soon as you get back from the chop shop, we'll get a burger. We won't even talk about it. You'll have more kids with a man that's going to post you. Okay. So now here's the second post that DeAndre made. This is now beneath me for real. Like I said, got me arguing with a dusty bee over a dog A-N. I need to snap back. Y'all can have each other. Go be toxic. Let the devil continue to have his way with y'all. I'm done with all this. Coming at me like I can't go get a real man in a million dollar tomorrow. Sister, then go do it. Don't talk about it. Be about it. Okay? The best you can get is Jacquees. That the lucky I even looked his way. You lucky I even gave you some shine. You gave the whole thing too much shine. You made her... You made her song trend, okay? Um, stay in your lane. You got him. You can have him. Enough is enough. I ain't saying another thing in this foolery. Done took me out of character and ish. Ish does hurt, but oh well, sister. Stop saying it hurts. Quit showing your chest. Where are friends? Where is the group chat? I would have been like, check what I should do. You don't feel hurt. You feel fine. Then pop out with your million dollar dude like 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 you don't even know what they talking about. You you don't you don't even this ain't even got nothing to do with you. You feel me? Like y'all do too much talking and not enough doing. Did he really be playing in Jack Queen's face? That's really where he wanna be, but you know, he has to settle for DeAndrea. Personally, I would have got rid of that baby. Like <laughs> I'm sorry. I, he don't want you. Like I, I just feel like he don't want her. It's just like that's who he, he can get right now, but he really want Dreezy. But DeAndrea went public with their relationship now dreezy and jacques saw exes they was on and on and off again mm -hmm. for years or whatever this came um after after he ended it with dreezy or whatever or dreezy ended it with him she's uh recently she she went online and she said my ex is obsessed with me now deandre and jacques they went public in december like like around christmas or whatever mm -hmm. and um dreezy has sent him some underwear with her face on it to the house or whatever this was before christmas it was back in december but it was before christmas so she wanted to stop it like she wanted to she wanted to let him know like you might get a package at your house from me you know but please throw it away it's from a long time ago mm -hmm. right he wanted to give it to her in person you know to any excuse to see your ex but this is now back to the tweets so she said my ex is so obsessed with me it's so cute so then De deandrea responded to dreezy and was like why would he switch out a dime for a penny now okay. right, you just you're supposed to just relax a little bit don't say nothing so then she tweeted again dreezy and he say nothing and deandrea tweeted again and was like obsessed is when you still send the underwear with your face on it to the crib so then dreezy came back and said no obsessed is y'all having a baby on the way but the nigga begging me to get pregnant because he barely f with you bird brain <gasps> yeah this is this is getting it's already gotten like that yeah i don't think she should have been with this guy but you know when you think you're in love I guess that's who you're going to be with.
It's crazy. I was like, oh my God, no. That, that, <laughs> that is crazy, right? Now, listen, what's crazy about this, Dreezy, and I'm going to beat her butt for this, because they didn't even expose the fact that they was having a baby yet, you know, so she actually put that out there. You know, and that's how she announced it. Yeah, but well, we're going to end it right there, guys. Because the main part of this video, you guys know about it. The main part of the video is what I really want you guys to see, that part. And this is like just recapping everything and just went on, so... With that said, I'm done breaking bread.